everybody. Okay, so we are getting ready to get our garden started for 2022. Right now, I just want to show you what we got left over from the winter time, which is pretty good. Um, right here, we got strawberries that's still alive, that's ready to grow back. I also planted some new strawberries right here, like two days ago. And you can see this little baby one is starting to grow right there. Um, over here, we have, this is our fig tree, our fig plant that's coming back. It survived the winter. Over here, I just planted some tomato seeds here like two days ago. But over here we have, this is a blackberry vine that survives every winter. We had this vine for about three years now. So every year we get a couple of blackberries from it and it's still going strong. Um, over here, we got a lot of cabbage that survived the winter. Uh, we got cabbage. Right here we got celery that's still alive and looking good from the winter time. Um, let me show you. Here we have some, uh, we have some, we have some sweet potatoes that we never picked, but we can't eat them now, but I dug them up. <laughs> we, we have some sweet potatoes, but that's no good. I gotta just go back here. We have plum tree that's growing back. Here's another plum tree. Right here we have That's coming back from last year. Right here, we have cabbage. More cabbage right here. Um, here we have some blueberries that's still going strong for the winter. Over here, we have more cabbage that survived the winter. We are off to a good start. A lot more seeds to plant, but I just wanted you to see what survived the winter, and we did pretty good. I just want to show you. We have survival garden seeds. So these are emergency seeds here. We're not gonna plant these. We're gonna plant these. So this is what we're gonna be planting for the spring. We have peas and broccoli and carrots and turnips and kale and beets and cabbage and eggplant and radish and spinach and squash and lettuce and okras and green beans and sweet peppers and corn and zucchini. So that's some of the things that we're gonna be planting this summer. Um, but yeah, y'all, if you never planted anything, you better learn now because things about to really kick off and you gotta know how to survive. You gotta know how to plant your own food and grow your own food. So hopefully we'll do better this year in terms of um, having longevity with the plant, but that's what it is.